Will by Fruit have grown 50% in volume over a short period of time, disrupting a very mature industry. This has been made possible through continuous improvement at every level of our organisation and driven by our desire to be our customer's first choice. From the moment we arrive and reverse park support on our zero harm plan to removing waste from our key processes to achieve an 85% just in time target, we continuously engage cross functionally to achieve our zero waste site strategy. For us, our mission is to be our customer's first choice. And by customers, we mean everybody we touch, not just retailers. Being transparent and making sure what we want and how we want to work is clear. We need to be sustainable and lean. And with our customers, we want to be winning with them. We want to be helping them grow. We've always had values which were created by the teams here. Everything has to be proactive and drive us forward. Alongside being open-minded and inquisitive, we also want to share we're first. And there's no point in doing these things unless we implement change. We have to be right first time on everything we do. We have to love our products. And overall, as a business, what are our high personal standards? And then how do we work? We cooperate and we collaborate. We recognise and respect that not everyone's the same. We need to be the people that when we see a colleague struggling, we ask, can we help? We never wait for them to ask us for help. And as we work this way, we have to measure everything. Our continuous improvement system is based on A3 and A4 projects, or our current A3 projects. They are displayed on these boards. These boards are available to whole business to view and feedback. We regularly meet and basically catch up with uh, the improvement teams and discuss their progress. These so-called CR check-ins are dedicated to keeping momentum of the projects, coaching the teams through difficulties and barriers, engage them and further support in continuous improvement. We started to see more and more projects that are much more short term, uh, their context is slightly limited to the big ones and so we came up with a, a different approach and we created so-called A4 projects. It's more focused uh, educational tool for those who, who would like to get uh, the first step into a continuous improvement system. Teams are encouraged to share their learnings and experiences. These case studies are shared and displayed throughout the business, shared with our customers and other people who are interested in how we went about a problem. So we've been growing our own talent here at Worldwide Fruit for a number of years and have uh, formalised the process into something called our growing our own strategy. Our vision talks about being uh, one of the best fresh produce companies in, uh, in the UK, developing our, our own people, uh, recruiting the best people and uh, continuing to reward them with, a, with an excellent and rewarding work experience. So offering qualifications in ILM and CQM, uh, including Yellow Belt and Green Belt with SA partners, uh, create a defined platform to build our great teams. Having an integrated and engaged workforce ensures that we can develop skills and behaviours which allow the business to deliver success throughout. The objective was to uh, improve profitability and also improve environmental waste, both in terms of fruit waste and packaging. What we found was that 43.6% of all waste end-to-end -end was lost in the M&S supply chain in the last 100 yards. We actually needed a senior analyst working in M&S full-time to be able to track this data on a day-to-day -day basis and actually have more influence in the chain. So the result of which was a staggering savings. We saved £2.1 million in cost savings. We reduced fruit waste by 577,000 kilos and we reduced packaging waste by 4,200 kilos. We identified that the line leaders were walking 99 miles a year um, moving in between the production lines and the print room to get the uh, materials that they required um, for the packing jobs. One of the countermeasures we put in place was to get the order of the jobs in a, a uniform sequence uh, day after day so that the print room and the line leaders were working in balance with each other. This gave us an annual saving of £987,000 a year. Since 2011, Walleye Fruit has grown by 100%. This has gone from 36 million packs in 2011 to a forecasted 72 million packs in 2018. 
in a very mature industry, in a market where there's not a lot of growth, this has come at the expense of our competitors. In order to do this, we've unlocked capacity by stripping waste away layer by layer. For every extra 5% we unlock, we can pack an additional 178,000 units each week. So the growth of jazz apples in the UK has actually been disruptive to other apple varieties in terms of taste, flavour, consistency, uh, which are fantastic jazz attributes and has actually given the consumer a better product, a more consistent product to eat on a day-to-day -day basis. Um, so I went into it positively but then I became quite defensive because in the first three or four sessions I had people almost telling me I was doing that wrong, I should need to look at things in a different way which I quite personally found it hard to take. Uh, but I slowly saw the benefits of the lean thinking, the lean attitudes, and also the lean processes. So I began to look at things a lot differently, changed the way I viewed problem solving in my life as well as it did in the workplace. Lean is not just something operations do. It's how we do business at all levels and our growing our own strategy emphasises our cross-functional nature towards CI. Today, in this financial year, they're set to hit around £158 million revenue, significant growth in both revenue and profitability. And that has been underpinned by a significant improvement in the culture and their ability to create a system of continuous improvement. You only need to go to the shop floor and ask at random any employee about continuous improvement to see what depth of culture they have created in their company.